Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays RimWorld Beta 18. Got a lot of nice little things from trades here recently, including a telescope, some Glitter World medicine, some other things. I think it was a pretty nice little haul myself. Let's put the telescope, like, over here. There you go. Just put it up somewhere for now. Got plenty of animal prosthetics, because, you know, that's what you need sometimes. Let's look at this, a schematic cabinet. It apparently makes your research better. So, I would like this. But I also need lamps in here. This is a wa this is a floor lamp tile. I wonder if I put it right here, could it make up for this? Because if it could, I could put the schematic cabinet right there. Like, do this. And then undo this. Oh, yeah, that's plenty good. Look at that, that's plenty good. All right. And it's a floor tile, so you can still walk over it, technically. Okay. Cool. Schematic cabinet, then. Goes in here. We'll turn it all around. Get me to put it in there right away. He's actually done it. Hello, Warborn Shield Belt. How you doing? Right, you are still wearing a shield belt, though, right? Why are you not wearing a shield belt anymore? You should definitely be wearing a shield belt, sir. So, we're going to have you put this back on. There you go. So, that'll... These both help research speed. It's up by 15% now. That's pretty sexy. If our animals need new hearts or lungs, we could always sell them and buy them and all that. What? Uh... Hey guys, Marcelo fell down. Can we like maybe rescue his butt before he dies in nine hours? As payment, I'll take your submachine gun. But yeah, let's not let him die, please. Oh, what was that? Well, I, oh yeah, we're we're hunting. Duh, we're hunting giraffes. But also, it's a war merchant from the White Mesa Nation. How y'all doing? Nice to see you here. We're gonna be hunting here. I hope you don't mind. Uh, I mean, that's definitely the sound of Dismas hunting. Oh, okay. No, they're just gonna shoot each other now. How about we hold off and watch the fireworks? No, this is fine. This is fine. Wow, they actually completely wrecked them. Wow! That was actually, like, insane. I mean, thank you as well for the free stuff, I guess. We got some 500 pemmican and a good spear of knowledge. And an Iqua of winter. And also a couple of people knocked down here. So let's go ahead and save them if we can. Let's uh, get a couple of rescues done here. We got porcupine and red. We'll pick them both up. All right, don't worry. We got someone coming for you. D-Wright's got you. And a Primitive Spear of Tundra, which is pretty good. And a Militia Rifle. All right. Oop, I missed some. There you go. What is this? Recur Bow of the Scout. It's terrible. Well, this just seems to keep happening. Is that a triple bed? That is a triple bed of linen cloth. It's a royal triple bed of linen cloth. Dude. Dude, I want this. <laughs> I am a greedy man. I mean, it's here. You might as well use it, right? All right, well, Bourbon exited the map healthy, so they like us more. Someone out there likes us. You know what, even though it's poor art, we should put some art in here. Marcelo is no longer incapable of walking. That's good. That's what I forgot. We don't use medicine on people who aren't part of our actual colony. So all these guys are just getting the basic treatment. We are actually... We might actually be terrible people. Oh, this does still have the worn by a corpse thing. Okay. I thought that went away, but no, it's still down here. It's good to know. It's good to know. It's good information. Alright, Porcupine 
is very grateful for the rescue. He's a skilled medic, he's tough, and he's trigger happy. Alright. Sure. Who am I to say no? I mean, look at him. He looks like the happiest dude. He's in shock from exceptional pain. Oh, and he was also feeling bad, but sure. He's got melee. He's got uh, some growing skill. He's got pretty good crafting skill, actually. For a skilled medic, he's not very good at the medic thing, but you know what? We'll take what we can get. Teach him how to do some things here. You should all have some flicking skill, please. Let's see. You can do growing, so do that at a two. Plant cutting, do that at you know, do that at a one. Go get plants for us. And then, uh, since you're really good at tailoring, let's have you do crafts and smithing. We'll hold off on tailoring for now. Don't do management though. And then clean overhauling. All right, thank you, Porcupine. I appreciate your support. Do we even have a bed for you? I actually don't think we do. This is actually we do because I just moved over there. This is my bed. I don't understand. My bed is the one with the purple frame on it, you see. Nice. And we just keep getting... We keep discovering new stuff. Calling this missing primary weapon. You don't need that. Yeah, go wear some clothes. Wear whatever's gonna make you happy. And also, while you're at it, here's a bone longsword for you. Cool. We'll get you a gun eventually, too. Like a crappy gun. Oh, there you go. Crappy gun. Tell you what, Porcupine, when you're done uh, with the party, why don't you go equip this machine gun? Alright, he had a little bit of time to party. He liked the rec room. A bulk goods trader from the Grey Crag Amalgamation is here. Nice to see you guys. Hope you're all doing well. We did patch Red up, right? We didn't, we're not just leaving her here. Okay, we did. Good. Now that is going to be our last free bed for now. So if we want more colonists, we're going to need to start expanding. And we could expand a little bit more on the right side. Kind of done on the left. We could expand a little bit to the south as well. Uh, Root is confused. Sorry to hear this. Hey, we get, they dropped the Neutromine. That's actually really good. Man, it looks like we got a little bit more of this, uh... Oh, yeah, we're getting this plowed. That's right. That's fantastic. Anyone working on that bulk of shells? Nope, not yet. Or if we start adding them, likes us a little bit more. Because their boy got out. What more could he ask for? Deconstruct this armchair and this bed. These are garbage. Triple, could you, like, haul in this Neutromine? It's good stuff, man. In fact, uh, we should probably eventually have a drug bench. I thought we did the research for it already. Maybe not. All right. That's fine. We didn't. We really didn't do the research for it. No, it's still right here. Okay, there you go. Reynolds, forty-four today. Happy birthday, Mr. Ray Ray. Hope you're doing well. Okay. Just in and out of the door, huh? That's not good. That's not good. <laughs> That's an infection in your arm. Someone, uh, wake up and take care of that, please. Maybe. No, you're just gonna get some loving. All right. Root's no longer confused. Sation, how you doing? Oh, you're also getting some... Oh, but now... Well, now Senpai's up, but you're not. Felt so good after that, he had to go find some slate chunks. Can someone tend to this? Bogue's got you. Bogue's got you. You should be fine. I mean, Porcupine, I appreciate what you're doing. I really do. Invulnerable. Holy jeez. I, I want more of this. Good lord. Invulnerable is amazing. Alright, can someone work on the... Uh, I, I appreciate Dismas going around maintaining everything, by the way. 
I don't appreciate uh, Reynolds shoot frenzy too much, but that's just because it's weird. He shouldn't have a shoot frenzy. Gives himself the 16 shooting scale porcupine at a major break risk here. He needs to get over his friend's death. I mean, 11 people died. I get it. It's bad. It's not great. But uh, you need to go make yourself feel better, dude, because you're really close to having kind of a problem. And uh, we got a couple of solutions by the name of Reynold D. Wright. Uh, let's see. What are our other solutions? Senpai is a solution. And Pepsi's a solution, too. So, you know, you may not want to cause problems. I'd never traded with the Grey Crag, did I? No, they, they just... They were here for like five seconds and they up and left. All right. Bye. Guess you didn't really want to trade that badly anyway. What were they, a war merchant, I think? It's not that big a deal. I don't think we missed it on too much here. How are we doing on stuff? Oh, we got 1,200 steel. That actually makes me insanely happy. All right, get this gun done. Let's let's not put any weapons in here anymore. No, okay, no weapons go in here. Where have our weapons been going? Because I feel like we've been selling them. No? They can go in here. That's fine, because our traders don't go in there, right? Our guests. They don't go in there. I feel like one of the weapons got sold, though. Reynolds' birthday party is being held right now. Gigi's going to take some time off, enjoy it. Porcupine, hey, why don't you come over to a, to a birthday party? That'll make you feel better. I'm not going to give you a name if you're going to be just a grump puss all, all the time, you know? Yeah, there you go. He's made it. Talk to people. Get social. Senpai's already your friend. Let's go. There you go. There you go. He's doing it. Look at that mood go up. That's bad. Oh, wow. Our, uh... This thing is full. And it immediately climbed to, like, 60 degrees. Oi. Oh, you know what? Maybe after it's... You know what? If it's... If the temperature's low in here, I could probably create an ice gathering station to gather ice for, like, free. And then put it in a fancy ice box to keep it cool in here while it... You know what? I might try that. Apparently, uh, I'm no longer inspired. What else is new? I had inspired trade, and I didn't use it because I'm a dinkus. Am I butchering animals? I have nothing better to do in this life. All right. Hallelujah. We could use the meat, especially since these things are going to decay. Slowly. Hopefully we'll get to use all this before any decaying happens. Oh, solar flare is over. Okay, temperature should drop in here quite quickly. It's in the negatives again. All right, so. Ice creation station. Cannot be placed under a roof. Why? You telling me ice doesn't form inside of a roofed area? Because I challenge that concept. I don't want to use hay, man. Hay has so many other extremely important uses. Oi. And it's never going to get into freezing out, out here in the wild. Come on, Gigi, get that light machine gun done. I want this one here. Ah, well, there she goes. All right. <laughs> but I guess you don't have to do it immediately. See, now, now the man's in a good mood. He's done it. He's ascended. He's ascended to a decent state of mind, which is really all I needed. Reynold and Dismas still training. I assume Dismas is only training because he has nothing else to shoot. Ooh, don't let that skill go down, boy. He's done it. Oh, wow. It's actually very hard to keep his skill up at, uh, at that level. 
Sook has given birth. Apparently, we have a muffalo named Sook as well. I did not know that. I don't think there are any animals over here to uh, hunt right now, so... I mean, we got an Ibex, though. Woohoo! Okay, I'm wrong. All right. Hunting party time. Triple Strike will bring you along, too. Let's go. Let's get some meat. Let's get a lot of meat. Oh, this is... No, 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 no. Don't... Please, keep going down here. I want you guys, like, right over here. I'm gonna slow it down, though. Let you guys move at a regular pace for a minute. While I put a growing zone. Oh, we got apples, too. Right here. And in this growing zone, we're gonna do rice. Because rice grows very quickly. Where be rice, yo? Yo, where, where is rice? I see, uh... Lentils and beans. Beans can be used to make tofu. But uh, I want rice. Because rice kind of has that reputation already. You see, there it is. There you go. Okay, I could look at other things too, maybe. But uh, I think rice is going to be the best one. Simply because of how quickly it grows. Alright. Everyone down here yet? Nope, just Dismas. Boy's too fast for you. All right, let's go. Run, Volpy, run, Volpy, run better. Oh, run better than that. Oh, jeez. Why is Triple Strike not shooting? Oh, because you you don't run and gun. There you go, run and gun, boy. You are totally permitted to run and or gun as necessary. Just thought I'd let you know that. All right, another Brontosaurus. This is how you get the real meat. All right, let's go. Please don't accidentally shoot our own. I would appreciate that. All right. Let's go. Oh, Dismas can't get a shot off because he uh, takes so long to aim. Tell him to go farther. Dude, that gun is so good. Uh, don't melee attack it. Actually, just finish it. No, you don't understand. Wait. Finish it. Okay. That'll do. Thank you. Oh, also, you don't need to be drafted anymore. Go home. Bogue, what's wrong? Hot and hungry and feeling terrible. I guess I could understand that. Porcupine is almost healed up. And his mood is a lot better now, so... Even though he's going to be in a moderate amount of pain, probably forever. Converted bolt-action rifle. You don't say. Alright. So meat's not, no longer going to be a problem. And we got lots of apples and bananas. And we got textile traders. Yes, we do. We got textile traders. How about you? Oh. So many textiles. We could sell blended leathers and stuff to them. Which is kind of what I want to do. Devil Strand, we're not using it. Yeah, blubbery leather. Nah, we don't need to. We can keep the blubber. Get rid of a lot of this other stuff, though. Tawny Pelt, I'm going to keep that. Because occasionally we use it. We'll get rid of this hide. We'll get rid of this hide. Triceratops hide's worth a lot. Basically, just a chance for us to get some uh, money and to make inventory space. Let's see. Most of these shirts are good enough to keep. Most of these are not. And you know what? They're worth like two bucks each. Considering there's something we're never going to wear, that's a good deal. All right. Excellent. Wooly horse hide waist cloth. They, it itches a little. Yeah, it, can, it can go. Spider silk hood. Cool. Apparently it gives you ultimate protection from the wind. Nifty. Anyway, I think we're good. At this point. Thank you for the silver. Definitely make good use of it here by calling in other traders from other places. Okay, and now... 
we just wait for research to get done. Because once that ground penetrating scanner is done, things are going to pop off. You'll see. And it's not something we need on all the time, which is something to keep in mind, too. Did we get all of the uh, chem fuel done yet? No, we did not. That's why that shell's not getting made. Okay. Tell you what. Me. Let's go pop off this chem fuel here. Does 50 coal become 50 chem fuel? Please tell me it does. It becomes 35. Alright, so we're losing... Hey, what are you actually doing? We can put it in here. We don't need to put it elsewhere. Yeah, it doesn't go in there. You don't put chem fuel in these, please. Copy settings. Paste settings. Chem fuel doesn't need to go in here either, all right? Check your padding. <laughs> okay, let's go. Put it back here and then do some more of this. If you'd be so kind. All right. Now we're making chem fuel. But not any person is butchering. But we're making veggie kibble. And that's actually important because we have no starving animals right now. I didn't even notice that until this point in time, but that's so beautiful. That's actually, like, incredibly good. We're almost at 200 chem fuel. Just need to do one more set. Oh! Wait, was that Vasilla? She's making high explosive shells. She's making them in bulk! Alright, clear prioritized work. I'm good to go. Go eat, go rest. Eat a banana, yes. That's how you do it right there. Does it give me a good thought? Mm, not necessarily, although eating in that bedroom apparently turned it into an impressive dining room. Vasilla, no! You don't need to eat your pemmican right now. I'm mostly kidding. Dude, we gotta clean this place up. Tidy up these carrots, please. Like, what the hell? Alright. Thank you. Because there's room in here. We're just not utilizing it effectively. She's back on it. It's almost done. She has done it. 50 shells! Now, how much, uh... Big bulk incendiary. 300 chem fuel. Alright, well. We'll just, uh... Up that to 300. That's not gonna be a high priority, though. EMP shells. We had eh, 10 components. It's not too bad. And the fire foam ones require just steel. Oddly enough. But I think we're good to go with that. Actually, you know, disassemble mechanoid should still be the top priority. We'll keep this here, just in case we need to do it again. Textile trader's gone. See you in the next millennium. Anti-material rifle is made. Tactical helmets and vests are fine. Light machine gun is go. There's a normal quality light machine gun, and I'm okay with that. Deconstruct these. And we're going to replace them with embrasure tiles. Where are the embrasure tiles? Right here. Steel, please. Do it up. That way, when we have invaders head that way, they will be in for a heck of a surprise. Okay, this is topsoil now, so can I... I, I no, it's fertilized already. Okay, it's 140. Can we plow topsoil? We cannot. <sighs> okay. I mean, it's, it's not fine, but it's fine. I can't do there because of the fountain. That's fine. That's actually fine. Okay. No, it is what it is. These are done. This can now shoot out. It'll be perfect. Could even be professional. Who even knows anymore? I feel like this should be replaced with a normal door now. I'm going to do that. It's not as strong as an embrasure door, oddly enough, but I want these guys to be protected when they're going to refuel their ammo. You understand, I'm sure. Almost done with that. So close. Get this door done instead, though. It's actually important. Hey, even more kibble. 
carrying 500 kibble. What an actual champion. We have bulk kibble for days. Can we make bulk veggie kibble? We cannot. It's good to know. I might be done with the veggie kibble order then. But I'm not sure. Hey, do all urgently, please. Yo, me. Did you, did you see the, the steel in the middle of the door? It's kind of holding it open. I don't know if you knew about this. It's unfortunate. There we go. And while you, after you do that, tidy up the shell. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. We should stop putting steel down here, too. You know what? Steel and components... Those don't need to be sold. Doing things I should have done a while ago. No steel in here. No components in here. Uh, components are probably under manufactured, yes. All right. Anything else that I see in here that should no longer be? Not really. Everything else is fine. Bone is fine. Plasteel. Plasteel should not be in here. Or Plasteel Thread. I don't even know what that is, but let's not put it in here. Copy settings. Select similar. Paste that sucker. Also, don't put it in the floor. On the floor in here. Yeah, it's already not. That's all good. And in here... I would prefer the steel go in here. Down here. You know how it is. So, yeah, I'm going to say don't put it in here. No Plasteel, no Plasteel Thread, whatever that is. No components. Components? Where you manufactured that? No components. No steel. Okay. That'll let us clean up that room a bit. It'll be good, you'll see. Can't uh can't neutral mean go in here? No. I would need to make a different storage area for neutral mean. So once we do get drug production going, we're gonna need to make sure to fix that. Okay. We got rice growing. Apples are still here. They're still doing fine. Banana's doing all right. Wheat's growing. Strawberry. Carrots. We have a good variety here. And steel is getting put down here where it's meant to be. Which is good. Very, very good. And actually, now that we have the... Uh, just realized, now that we have Glitter World Medicine, we should probably... Go ahead and unsuspend your eye surgery here. Put you in a bed. Let someone get that done. And by someone, I mean Seishon. Can you go ahead and do this? Yeah, we just need to use one. All right. We're gonna give Rain all a new eye. It'll be pretty great. We're not gonna give him a scyther blade. Prosthetic hand is tempting, but uh, I don't think he's missing that much on his hands, is he? I don't know. His manipulation is down to 68. Maybe we should. Yeah, we'll put a prosthetic hand on his right hand here. We'll use the other Glitter World Medicine for that. Oop. That's done. Oh my god, the boy has two eyes. He can see like a regular human-ish. This will. This is actually going to be a huge boost to his... Uh, combat effectiveness here. There's the rest or there's his eye patch. Alright. Well, if anyone else ends up missing an eye we can fix it. Muffalo is giving birth. Root is confused. We have turkey eggs that are fertilized. It's all well and good and good and well. And research is almost done. It's like on the precipice of victory here. We're so close. Here we got here. Ten rich soils that need to be done. We should be able to do that with no problem. Ground penetrating scanner is done. Revenge cat is made. Oh, where do we even go? Composite armor. Safety standards. Actually, safety standards is probably a good thing. Let's uh, learn how to make safety stuff. And then I think we will start on... We could do power... Ma we could do better management. Yeah, actually being able to build that... Uh, AI is a good thing. Let's head that way. But we now have the ground penetrating scanner. And the long range mineral, mineral scanner. Let's not forget about that. Let's actually drop this thing here somewhere. 
It's gotta be on roof, duh. Okay. Hmm. I guess I can plop it down here for now. We definitely have the components. Looks like we're good on the steel, too. Same thing with the penetrating scanner. Can this be placed under... This can. So we'll place it under a roof. Okay, so that's going to take up a bunch of power. We're already actually losing wattage at a slow rate here. We can build a couple more of these. So let's do that. Doesn't hurt too much. We could always look for more um, avenues of power later as well. Tawny pelt button-down shirt is infused. What a great job. You just put it on? Yes, you did. It's hard. Reynold can walk again. Great. How's, our, how's his new stats? Manipulation, 69 went up by 1%. Great. His sight is now 80%, though. That is a huge boost. That's probably a much bigger boost to his combat effectiveness than one realizes. Okay. So things are going all right. I think I actually think things are good right now. Better than all right. Does a coal-fired generator produce less than a chem-fuel-powered one? I mean, the chem-fueled one... I'm, I'm going to test this, but... Uh, Yeah, we'll put a chem fuel power generator down here to test it. Worst case scenario, it doesn't, and we just get rid of it. Which is kind of what I'm thinking. They probably all put out a thousand watts, but you won't know until you try. And if it does, we'll just put another one right here, and then we'll line this room up with chem fuel and be able to make chem fuel out of coal as well. We can also make it out of other stuff too, like uh, organics, like food. We can make it out of bamboo. We can it out of wood. You could make them bulk out of wood. Or bulk out of organics. Can't make it bulk out of bamboo, though. So that's unfortunate, actually. Probably line this up with uh, gravel, too. It'll just look better. Okay. I don't know if that's been making anyone mad recently, but if it has, I apologize. We'll do one more day, then we'll probably call it an episode here. Dude, how you doing? Oh, and Drago Wood, what a helpful puppers. Hillary, you're a helpful puppers too, I appreciate it. Safety standards got done in no time. Alright. What does that actually give us again? Gives us checkered trousers, cargo pants, aprons, bib aprons, surgeon aprons, overalls, chef hats, hard hats, welding mask. Okay. I should probably get like doctor stuff for Sation. Because I don't know if you knew this, but she's like our best doctor. Let's take a look here. Oh my god, we have so many things. Like, there's a medic's bandana. And there's scrubs. Surgical scrubs. It takes two medicine to make scrubs. But I think it would be worth it if we made good quality scrubs. So I tell you what. Only Gigi can do this, because she's most likely to make good scrubs. I can rename the bill. Cool. Make one of these. Hopefully it'll be good. I'm actually going to make this a higher priority here. Once it's done, we will make sure that only one person wears it. So I need to manage my outfits. If you're a non-fighty boy for now, let's not have you wear scrubs. And if you're a fighty boy, you shouldn't be wearing it either. But just by default, yeah, shooty boys don't wear it. Melee boys don't wear it. Nudie boys don't wear it. Worker boys do. Change that for now. Anything boys, they do, of course, as well. So, yeah. And uh, let's see. Got a couple of people we haven't changed their clothing to for yet, but that's okay. That's okay. We'll get those scrubs done. Kind of stinks that it's going to take two medicine to do so, but eventually we can make medicine, so who cares? Alright, more coal-fired generators are good. Wattage is definitely going up now. 
All right, cut, oh, there's our uh, long range mineral scanner, which it looks like we can support with no problem, which is great. This will eventually tell us if we can go out and find some gold or some s silver. No, I want to say gold or jade, I think, are the only two things you can see. Okay, so the chem fuel generator right now has no power output, but I'm assuming it's going to be the same as everything else, but we're about to find out. Yeah, it's the same as everything else. Although it has a nice blue color to it. <laughs> it actually lights up this room plenty well. And Vasilla's making chem fuel, so I guess I don't see a reason to be mad about it. Yeah. Hell, I'll build another one. If we can afford it, we can. I don't even have to look at the components. I know we have a lot of components right now. 300. Components are not the issue. Alright. Gigi's making scrubs. Good, good, good. Ground penetrating scanner is done. And we are at positive power. So, we are good to go for... Kind of forgot how many good things we had there. We are good to go to find some stuff. So, Reynold, sorry, we're going to have to build this here. We're going to build one there. These are probably like steel and stuff like that, but the only way to find out for sure is to put a penetrating scanner there. This might be something actually valuable. But yeah, I want to go ahead and get these built. Get the ones inside of our base first. This one is like in reach of our base, so that's good enough. Got a lot of other places too. And we don't know what's under them, but that's not relevant because we could just build these. They don't cost that much. If one of them is steel, we're fine. Because nine spots of steel completely pay for the ground penetrating scanner and everything else, basically. The uh, deep drills is in particular. Anyway, I just got to wait for them. But Vasilla's already got one done. Steel. All right. Well, I would definitely want to milk this for all it's worth, so definitely steal up as much of that as we can get. Now we're just waiting for the other ones to get made. Nice. We got plenty of power output now. Gonna have another one done here. Vasilla's just building these like crazy. I thought she had to stop for a minute, though. Steel. All right. More steel. Still a good thing. Put one here. Put one here. That'll pretty much milk that for all it's worth. All right. Ooh, the one on the outside. Yeah, I kind of want to see what this one is, so I appreciate you working on it. Jade. Sweet. All right. That is going to be it for this episode of Fet Plays RimWorld Beta 18. Deep drilling has begun. We are going to get a lot of resources now. We're going to hoard them. We're going to become a crazy colony. As per usual, basically. Anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, make sure to let me know by giving it a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more RimWorld. Because you know it's going to keep coming. We'll put some flooring down in here as well. Thank you again for watching this episode of Thet Plays RimWorld Beta 18. My name is Thet. And I will see you in the next video.